Hello there and welcome to another one of these Lexical Lab one minute English videos. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our website www.lexicallab.com to find out more about the online lessons we offer. Over the weekend, I was chatting to a friend of mine who has a daughter who's exactly the same age as my daughter, 14. Unlike my daughter though, his daughter is an ardent user of social media and this has been causing a few problems recently in their house because she's had some snarky, unpleasant comments on some of the pictures she's uploaded from some of the mean kids in her school and because as my friend put it, she's quite thin-skinned, she's quite sensitive, she's ended up taking everything to heart. If you take a criticism or a comment or a piece of advice to heart, you think about it a lot, you think about it in a very serious kind of way, usually because it upsets you. And obviously, it's not a good thing, because there are going to be lots of things in life that people say or do that could be potentially upsetting. And so often, you end up having to give people advice, saying things like, listen, don't take it to heart quite as much as you do. You need to grow a thicker skin. And for any young teachers out there, a piece of advice um, that I hope you take seriously but that I hope you don't take to heart. Because if you're a teacher, it's not easy if you are very, very sensitive, if you're very thin-skinned. Because in those kind of situations, you do end up taking everything to heart. And if you're going to survive over the years in the classroom, you need to toughen up a little bit. You need to grow a thicker skin. You need to stop taking everything quite so personally. If you've enjoyed this video, please do click the like button. Please share it with your friends, your students, your colleagues. And in the comment section below, we'd love to see examples of how you might use Take Things to Heart.